and uh, so uh, St. Moses, uh, the Ethiopian St. Moses the Black, uh, was one of the uh, uh, very famous fathers of, of the Egyptian desert. Um, he'd lived his life, his life as a as a, a a robber, a murderer, and a brigand, and then he repented, and he became an elder um, of the uh, living in uh, living, living in great asceticism. Um, and when the uh, uh, when the monastery was going to be raided um, by the uh, by the barbarians, um, he said that well. He lived by the sword, he was taught by the sword. And so he, he stayed behind in the monastery and accepted martyrdom. Um, so uh, St. Moses the Black, as he's all uh, very commonly known as, uh, is, is, is a, I think a really uh, important saint for our day. Um, uh, he's certainly the patron of uh, many of the, uh, the African Americans who have entered into uh, uh, the Orthodox Church. In fact, there's a whole brotherhood St. Moses the Black, um, uh, Father Moses Berry, whom we should all, all be praying for because he just had amputations. So he was forced into retirement. But wonderful man um, uh, who is one of the real pioneers of uh, uh, mission in, in the black community, especially in Missouri. Um, and uh, um, so he's. he's He's a much beloved saint, and you know there are not too many people who can rival the kind of lifestyle he led before his repentance. But few also are the people who can even begin to rival uh, the the purity of his repentance. So, um, he's, he's, a, he's an incredible uh, uh, example.